Hello everyone, teacher Jackie here. I just get this thing where I just feel like I need to do another video. <laughs> and I don't just do videos just to do videos. I really want to share with, um, as I've always said in most of my videos, prospective teachers and current teachers, um, you know, my personal experience with VIP Kid. There are so many other companies out there that you can join. Uh, if you may or may not have seen any past videos, I had learned about VIP Kid about two and a half years ago. A friend of mine uh, joined, and I guess they had started a referral program, and they, she mentioned it. And I was like, VIP Kid? What, what's VIP Kid? And because she typed it, you know, on, on Facebook and shared it with a group of us moms. And so, I'm like, Psh, I'm not sure about that. Teaching English and China and all weird hours. Uh, no, I'm good. <laughs> Fast forward to last summer, um, money was getting really tight, and I had heard about it from someone else. And I was like, you know, that sounds familiar. And I looked it up and I asked my friend. Um, I was trying to use uh, another friend's referral code, it didn't work. I found another friend's referral code, it worked, so it doesn't matter who you sign up with, but if you are new, please click on my link and get referred. I can help you get, uh, I don't like to say hired, you get a contract, okay? You get offered a contract. Not everyone does. Not everyone does. Right now, VIP Kid is really being tricky, not tricky, that's not the right word, being picky <laughs> about who they hire. There are tens of thousands of teachers some numbers say 70 50 60 I don't know it's a lot a lot of teachers so you're in this big ocean you know and there are a lot of teachers not really representing the company very well they probably have bad posture they're probably all right kid read the next slide <laughs> I don't know I don't know what they're doing but I know that through um, corporate through the emails and through information that we get they're like you know please do these things these are our standards and you have to represent the company really well as you can see I have a very simplistic background some people have a very very great okay so my video today is to VIP kid or not to VIP kid? That is the question. So I wanna be honest. I am as honest as I can be, transparent. These are my little thumbs up. I'm, gotta, I'm actually gonna put stuff away while I talk to you. Uh, after class, your desk just becomes very, very messy. All right, so to VIP kid, why would I do this job, this gig? Well, <clears throat> let me clarify a few things first before we go into to VIP kid or not to VIP kid. Actually, let me do this. Oh, thanks. Because I'm always, and before I did this stuff, I'm not, I wasn't into this. I wasn't into, well, I always talked with my hands <laughs> and I always talk, <laughs> but this prop thing and all this other stuff was new to me. Really quick. Number one, VIP kid contracts you okay you go through the application process and you may get offered a contract or you may not get offered a contract they do have a new hiring system or application system where if you aren't doing well you get another try you get another try you get another try let's say you're tired and you're like you know what this is too complicated i want to take a week or maybe even a month off you can kind of do that now in the old system, you had like this two-week timer. If you couldn't get it done, bam, kicked out, and you had to re reapply, which is still great. You can reapply. You can reapply, okay? <laughs> so please get the mindset first, and then we'll talk about to VIP kid or not to VIP kid. Real quick, mindset. You're a contracted teacher. You're not an employee. I cannot stress this enough in my videos. Because I know some people, we all have this huge heart for this company. We have a huge heart for the students and the families. It, we become a family. I get that. But you're still not an employee. It is amazing how teachers will talk and the company will listen, okay? And things happen. So you feel like you're part of it, that you're like a shareholder, but you're not you're not an employee. You're not a shareholder. You are not, you know, there are some people that are, you know, have other positions. They do workshops. They help with uh, people get hired, the mentors and stuff. But remember, 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 you are a contracted person. 
they can like you or not like you, let you go, keep you. They can increase you. They can decrease you. They can keep you where you are. And so many get frustrated with that. So please get the mindset that you are a contracted teacher. There are so many people who rely on this for full-time income. Yes, some people work the basic six to eight hours a week, five to six days a week, some seven. Ah, take a day off, please, please, please take a day off for yourself and for your students and for humanity. But anyway, and they make a lot of great money. They make a lot of great money. Wow. Anyway, they make a lot of good money. And remember at the end of the year, you're responsible for your taxes, you know, so there's nothing taken out. This is a foreign company that has a US based, you know, base, and then they can pay you and get the wonderful deposit into your account monthly or bi-monthly, okay? Not bi-monthly, yeah, every twice a week, or bi-weekly. <laughs> Time for some more coffee. Anyway, so, to VIP kid or not to VIP kid? Well, do it. If you need some extra money, do it. Do it, do it, do it. You will be so glad you did. Now next year, next, actually this year, what is this? This is 2019, April 2019. Because of certain things I won't go into, we don't file in April. <laughs> we're going to file eventually, but anyway, we file, we, file, we file before October, but we're still doing our taxes because of things, and um, it's all good. It's, it's, it's normal for us. So I'm not sure the impact of, of what I need to to pay and I know our CPA has always said you know 25 30 35 percent as a self-employed person so you are self-employed um, definitely VIP kid if you if this is foreign to you like what self-employment what does that mean what is taxes oh my gosh now you just scared me you know what first go through the application process get offered a contract maybe hopefully teach that first class and then teach whatever classes you want there's no minimum. There's no maximum. Well, I think there is a maximum. I know my first contract had a maximum. But do what you can and do however you want, and then it's your classroom. So it's great to VIP kid for the extra funds. As full-time income, I personally would not put all your eggs in one basket. Uh, that's just me. But some people are doing it, and that's where a lot of them are really nervous about their future. Future, not like no, six weeks, six months from now, but maybe six years from now. What is that going to look like? Uh, there's talk about, you know, what VIP Kid will be doing. None of us know. I will say it is a very fluid company. It is very, very ever-changing. This is only my second contract. That means I've completed six months, and I'm in the second month of my second contract, so six, seven, eight, eight months into the company, okay? I would definitely say VIP kid if you like to teach. If you like kids, this is totally you. Honestly, I don't like to teach. And I'm okay with kids. <laughs> but, you know, the money's good, so I'm here. <laughs> so VIP kid, because it's all about the money. And there's other ways to make money. This is very simple, honestly. I am business and teacher up top, and I am pajamas and chilling out down below. Got my, actually put my house shoes back on. My feet are cold. <laughs> During class, I encourage my classroom to, kids to drink water. We talk a lot. We read a lot. Drink some water. It is not, you're not encouraged to drink or eat during class. You don't be like, you know, don't be like, oh my, sweet, sweet my. Wish I could edit this. But anyway, moving on. To VIP kid, because it's easy, because the money's good, and because I said so. Actually, the community's amazing. The teachers, the friends I've made online, there is a, a VIP kid group for like health. We all talk about, let's eat right. Let's get some sleep. How much water are you drinking? How many steps did you, did you get? I mean, it's an amazing group. And then yet we can still talk about like, hey, I'm not getting good sleep because I work so many hours. You know, we all understand waking up at 3, 4, 5 a.m. and whatever time zones we're talking about. So the community, the money, the cash, the kids, the ka 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 words. So it's really, 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 and I love this company. There are so many other companies. I dove into them, looked at them. Overall, this one I like and respect because a friend of mine has been with them for three years. And um, 
there's a lot of grievances about this company, but if you dive into those grievances, hmm, yeah, you'll realize it's not the company, okay? They do change their policies. They do upgrade their policies. Not really change per se, but they are fluent. Like I said, you've got to keep up with it. And you're a contractor, so remember that. You're not an employee, so don't be all mad and sad because, you know, this, the fine print says you're expendable. Okay, so to not VIP kid, if you don't like that feeling of not being an employee, not being completely catered to, then you probably shouldn't come here. If you don't like to wake up early, like ever, 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 even if the money's good, then you probably don't want to be here. If you um, can't change or adjust to this kind of teaching environment, then you probably don't want to be here. I am right now staring at this little thing. I don't know if I can get this without making a mess. I'm probably going to make a mess. Here we go. Here we go. Ready? Uh, I have this little thing right here. Props. And these are my kids' toys that I started to donate. Trash. Whatever. Maybe even sell. But then I realized these are great props for my classroom. Easter eggs. I started to get rid of all these. And then I realized... I can teach the word hatch with the word or open or empty with these words or with these eggs. Guys, I need some sleep. Orange, yellow, pink. What's your favorite color? If you can't do this, you probably don't want to. You know what? When I first started application process, I looked at them and they're like going, apple. And I was like, oh my God, Apple. Eh. I was like, this is not going to work out. So I actually I told my kids to leave the house, told my husband to leave the house, and I had to just get into this thing. So they're going to pay me some pretty good money to go, Apple. Apple. And I got it. And I'm like, you know what? That's pretty easy for some money. And for me, the money was to pay some bills. We were short on and needed and my kids want activities they want to go to the movies we can't usually go and if we go to the movies we can't order popcorn I mean who wants to go to the movies without popcorn so I don't know what your budget is or what and then you say you have money let's say you have every need taken care of but you want the extra manicures or the hair coloring or the pedicure or you want to take that trip to wherever Europe California DC South America um Austria, Australia, sorry, or, or Austria, I got friends there too, but really overall, if you don't need the money, and you're not interested, and you don't have very good internet, and you don't, um, I don't know, you know, this isn't for everyone, I think everyone thinks everyone is, is good for it, just because you may get hired, just because you teach at first class, this still may not be for you, and I've seen it. I've seen people vent about, oh, you changed the interface, and oh, I can't click on, you know, it's technology. No, it's not a perfect company. Yes, they make a ton of money, <laughs> but um, if you're not very forgiving, probably not the company for you. If you're not into community, you know, you don't have to be part of the community, <clears throat> excuse me, you may watch too many YouTube videos on other VIP kid teachers and go, ooh, ah, ouch. You know what? Stop watching the YouTube videos. Stop watching, um, you know, the Instagram posts and things because it can be overwhelming. But otherwise, really, sometimes it might be a turn off. So maybe, you know, another company might suit you best. But honestly, for most people, what gets them bummed is some of the changes of being fluid and um, policies and, oh, not feeling like an employee. So if you really want that employee feel, go somewhere else probably. Go get a job. Because <laughs> this is not a job. This is a side gig. Even if this is your full-time gig to pay all your bills, um, at actually any job, any job can be, go away immediately. Because someone else had something happen recently and I personally had a corporate job where we had quarterly bonuses. I had to, you know, meet the board of directors and I had to, I wore suit or heels or, you know, the whole thing. I've been there, been in corporate America and, and we worked with, I worked with um, clients in the UK and in Canada and all throughout Europe. And a week before Christmas, the Monday after the Christmas party, they let 
80 of us go in one department. Yeah. So just like VIP Kid might not offer you a new contract after six months, after your second six months, after your six, six months, some people are bummed. They've been in the company for three years, heart and soul, and they don't get renewed a contract or they don't get a 50 cent raise or whatever the requirements are. This is a company that's contracting you, okay? Get, remember that. So, to VIP kid or not to VIP kid? That's the question, and only you know that answer. But I do encourage people, especially stay-at-home moms like me, I have four kids, uh, to join and to be part of this awesome community. Very simple way to make some side cash or most of your income cash, pay the bills, and live life a little more financially free. All right. If you have any questions, message me. Like, share, subscribe, uh, comment. I'm here. Thank you. Bye. <laughs>